All right, Sunday Boiler School. Let's talk about correct piping for the Hartford loop back into the equalizer. So a lot of the times we see our boiler here piped riser, header, equalizer, supply at the top. And I see a lot of people in the field on Instagram piping their heart for loop way out here and then dropping down. So this point right here is causing massive, massive water hammer in the system. So as your cool condensate water is dropping down and filling up here. It has this far to travel back into the boiler. So your steam, which is born in the bottom of the boiler, is filling up and meeting this cold condensate water and causing that water hammer. So what we should be doing is have our boiler here, riser, header, equalizer, piping a close nipple off your T and a 90 straight down. So you make this connection the closest as possible. So as your water is coming down, you're just filling up this portion and it's dripping back into your boiler and your steam's coming up. So the longer that the horizontal connection between the loop and the equalizer is, the worse the water hammer will get. So if you use this close nipple, it will just drip down back into the boiler instead of having to travel so far to get back into the boiler and your steam and your cold water return will be more mixed.